Welcome back, everybody. Hope you're having a great day. So I decided today we're going to start off by working on this other end of the island. So I need to, uh, I want to build a dock and a warehouse. So first, I'm going to uh, clear out all the trees over there. So we're going to hop into a quick time lapse. So sit back, relax, enjoy the music, and I'll see you in just a little bit. There is that all cleaned out. So that gives me a better idea of what I can do over there. I'm not going to go all that way today. Today we are just going to go over here to do the, the warehouse. I think I need to put a road in here first. I forgot I did not put in a full road through here. Yes, I hear you sheepies. that and then this whole wall here needs to be worked on kind of push it back a bit and then put some buildings into it so I think I'm gonna have like a butcher shop in there maybe some well, I already built a storage shed but I guess more storage can't hurt well this is kind of awkward where this ladder is into the gate I might have to do something about that but I'm really putting this uh, road up one just because of the stupid snow but I think yes I did say I'm gonna stop bitching about it so I would just uh, hold my tongue and put my road down and we're not gonna worry about it At least the sheep can't get out of the pen because the short side is this side so I can get into the pen really easy you just can't get out I don't know if that's going to cause me any issues but at least my sheep are not going anywhere okay so we got our road we got our break dancing sheep that they really like to break dance so like here I want some stairs down. So I've got multi-level. So we're going to have this level, which is going to have a bunch of stuff here. And I don't remember that block being there last time. That's odd. And then we have this wheat field at this level down here. And we're going to continue that level over here with more. I think I'm going to just do wheat, 
maybe carrots, all that kind of stuff out through there. I've got one. One spawnable block. And it's going to be a creeper. I can just tell. So, but there needs to be a way down. So right here is where the warehouse is going to be. And it's going to be two-story. So the level that we're at will go straight into the docks over there. And I'm pushing it back. So this is actually going to be a wall right, yeah, right here is going to be a wall. So I'll have a wall here. This is the inside or the inside wall of the warehouse. goes out like this kind of kind of kicks back a little bit and then here is some stairs to get up and down and then we go straight into the road So this right here, where's okay, right here is going to be the edge of the warehouse. So we'll go like this, and then we'll cut it across here. There, I think. There. So this will be the upper story. And you'll go down and there'll be a lower story here. So we'll have, uh, let's do this. Uh, put that in there. I better go get some sleep before mobs do spawn because I'm sure I've got more spawnable areas. So it'll be right about there. And then we're going to have the, this is going to all be paved out like this, just so I don't get snow on it. And then we'll go up, and right here will be the dock. So our docks are going to go like here, like that. And then we'll have stairs up. I might get rid of this. Or, oh, actually, a better idea. Because I don't want the docks at water level. Because if I've got a boat, they're going to be on the water. So they're going to be up above the water. So my reason, you know, do this. Like that, and then there. That will be the dock. Oops. And then here will be the start of the wall. Kind of like you got the wall over there going around. You got the wall over here going around. And actually... Enemies, I see enemies out there. Actually, like that. So, dock out here, this wall here. Up there. And that is how things are starting to shape up. So things are starting to shape up around here. So we have this like plaza or pathway here it leads up to where the dock is going to be. Started pushing the wall up around here and the wall over there. So you get a pretty good idea how this is going to look. Um, 
maybe here I do have I do have a couple more of these so let's get those out of there and these out of here so if I do this and this oops and oh, come on that Oh, jeez Louise. Oh, brother. This is not going as smooth as it should. There. So we have this. Stairs gets us up to the next level. We're going to have a little fence that goes around like that. There'll be a fence on top there. Top this off with the fence just so it all looks the same. So that's uh, looking up. See over here, where's my torch? I'm just going to put some lighting in here. This is the warehouse building. So inside, where's that? We'll have a. Uh, Just sort of a mixed flooring. There, I think that looks pretty good with the mix. And in the walls, I want to put torches just so we have plenty of lighting in here. So let's see. I put spruce here and spruce here. Strip all that out. And that'll be actually, let's do a double door. Since it is a warehouse, I think a double door would uh, suit it. And then interior, let's get this. I guess I didn't need that the top one there. Actually I don't need there we go. Oops. And cobble. There we go. Like so. So this would be the main floor or the bottom floor. It's got all, you know, some storage and stuff in it. And then we'll do the same thing up top. Uh, through here. We'll do like stone there. And cobble in the middle like that. Go away, go away. I'm minding my own business. These two guys tried to mug me. Just standing down there, working on my warehouse. I need to put a roof on it now. Might as well show it to you. We'll see if we get mugged again. Very simple. I just went with uh, this oak for the walls so we'll have a little more storage area up here i'm going to go with a cobblestone peaked roof on top of it and then once you go downstairs we have just our main area right here i think i showed you that with the walls so i think i'm gonna put the roof on and then we'll uh probably put some storage stuff inside oh yeah we need to build the dock and then we should be Probably uh, finished up for the day.
there. Got my roof and everything on there. I was going to hang uh, the lantern from there, but I thought maybe just a couple on either side would be kind of nice. It's a little dark. Um, well, I think, yeah, let's see. I think I do have my uh, mob spawning indicator on. Uh, let's see. Let's see, do, do overlay, yeah, light overlay is enabled, so it'll show little X's if it gets too dark in here. And I think what's keeping it light is this torch right there. Yep. So we have that. Do. Mm, those are too thick, I think. I want some cross beams up here. Didn't have any wood on me, but those are way too thick. Let's see if I do the fence. The fence might actually work. Like that. Yeah, I think the fence would work, and then I'm going to put a light... Like that. And that should take care of any spawning mobs. There. We'll put a crafting table here. A couple doors. I have just some barrels of stuff. Thought that would be uh, something to be stored in here. Not too organized, just uh, just kind of like a holding holding place till it gets distributed to the rest of the uh, city. So, oops. Might as well have another crafting table here. Um, I don't need any lighting in here because I've got it hidden in the walls. But I think... We'll do that. Yeah, that'll look good. Yeah, that'll be okay there. There we go. So we have our warehouse area right there. And then the dock is going to go out this way. Oops. Oh, dang it. I can't get back up there. I have one edge attached to that. So out here, maybe like that, and then like that. But lanterns there. Let's just draw this all the way down. I might need... Yeah, I'm going to need one on the corner here. Yeah, like that. Relatively simple. Do I need a safety rail, you think? I'm not sure where I would put one. Because there's, because this is uh, the bottom half, so I can't put this rail on top there. The rail would go between, and I could still run over it really easily. 
I think I'm going to just leave this as is. I may come back and put a ladder there. But that means we're almost done. One last thing I need to do is get rid of all this dirt here. Because I want this all to be watered. So, I need to get so we're going to clear out all of this. And then we're going to fill it all in with water. And then it will freeze so it will be frozen water. That one more. Let's put that there, that there. I do have a couple buckets. And I can always do this. Let me actually do that. This may actually be quicker. And bucketing everything out. I may have to put buckets over here. Oh, well, yeah, that works pretty good. Let's just fill that in. I don't know what that is, but I don't like the way it looks. That's filling in nicely. I always forget, you know, when I'm trying to fill things in with water and stuff, that I could just take normal ice cubes or ice blocks and lay them down and you know around the perimeter, and you know, it's usually quicker to uh, you know place and break the blocks than it is to go through all this, you know, with the, each bucket individually. So. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. Let's get rid of this thing. Because I know I know who put it there. Okay, I think that takes care of this warehouse for today. Uh, next up, I'm not sure if I'm going to actually work on this end or head back over to the other side of the city kind of breaking things up here and there. I still need to level all this off maybe, unless I want something at this height. Need to figure that out. I'm not sure if I wanna have one more level here, or just lower it all down to this other level. I may just lower it all down, because it's a little easier to you know, get a good layout for things. And then I'll need to uh, take care of this wall and stuff. So we'll see. Uh, I'm not sure when that'll be. That may be in the next episode. Maybe in a few other episodes. I may have other things in between. But for now, I want to wish you all a great weekend. I hope you're having a great day. And continue to have one. And I will see you later. Bye-bye.